Hello travelers, today I thought we would do an update for September and let you know what's going on with the channel. And I thought since um, it's a fairly nice day, we might do a bit of a garden tour as well. <laughs> and he'll be leading the way on this tour. So Pixel. Pixel. <laughs> now going up here we have our clothesline. And we have a little garden here. He's very playful, he likes to... <laughs> Just up here we have a fire pit with some stuff ready to burn. Then we have a house and a very nice view of the water. A lot of these rocks are just natural rocks, like this one here, natural. <laughs> I'm being stalked. <laughs> so Pixel's just leading us up the rocks here, looking like the Lion King. So in terms of reviews, we have a review of the Bluff Works Packing Cubes, which will be coming very shortly. I'm going to be reviewing the Decathlon Neck Buff uh, and compare it to the original Wool Buff. A, another Zengio product review coming up. Um, it's a type of charger. I can't, I'm not sure if I'm allowed to say all the details of it. Um, I'm going to try and do some comparisons between the... Western Rise pants and the Outlier pants. I've been meaning to do those for a while and I've been meaning to do something like a, like a best travel towel. So I'll be comparing all the travel towels that I've tried and that I have. I was thinking also doing like a best travel backpack, something along those lines, because I do have and have tried quite a few different travel backpacks. Um, possibly also a best travel pillow, like a sort of neck pillow or a inflatable one um, so let me know if any of these sound interesting in the comments if you do want to see any of these kind of reviews or videos in the next couple of weeks and months also something along the lines of what to pack in a day bag or you know when you're just out and about in the places that you're going to be sort of touring around also I was thinking of doing an individual review on the Logitech K380 keyboard I previously did a comparison on like the best portable keyboards and that's still one of my most popular videos and I was thinking of doing like an individual review on that keyboard because it is still the one that I like the most and use every day. And finally, the new Logitech Master MX3 mouse for the Mac. I just got that and I've been using it for the last couple of weeks. And I really do like it. I'm not sure it's <laughs> considered like a, a good travel mouse, but it is Bluetooth and it's so comfortable and it's very handy to have if you are going to be doing anything on the computer while traveling. I know there's a lot of lighter and smaller mouses available, um, but that one really is, uh, it does live up to the hype. So if any of those things sound interesting, leave a comment of which one you're looking forward to or excited about. Also, thank you so much for the 8,000 subscribers. Uh, I can't believe that we got to 8,000 from, what was it, like 5,000 in just this year alone. So thank you so much for that. and. Looking forward to getting to 10,000 subscribers together. Uh, it looks like it's probably going to be early next year if the rate of subscribers keeps growing at the current rate. So thank you so much for staying with me. Uh, do leave a comment below of which of those reviews sound interesting and be sure to subscribe to keep up to date with future videos. Here comes the hunter. The black panther of the... <laughs> Here he is, Pixel. He's all playful. Pixel. 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 Say goodbye. <laughs>